The uh, IFM, uh, the French uh, cooperative group, is currently running a very large study in young patients. And we are running this study uh, together with the Hovon group in the Netherlands and also in Belgium. Uh, we are uh, going to enroll more than 1,000 patients, young patients, frontline treatment, uh, with the prospective comparison of VTD, uh, so a triplet induction with bortezomib, thalidomide, dexamethasone, followed by stem cell transplantation, followed by two cycles of consolidation with VTD, so VTD auto VTD, plus or minus daratumumab. So uh, upfront randomization of DARA or no DARA. DARA is a monoclonal antibody targeting CD38. And we would like to show that with the addition of DARA, we are going to improve the quality of the response and the primary endpoint of the study is the stringent CR rate following uh, consolidation. So VTD, auto, VTD, primary endpoint, stringent CR, plus or minus daratumumab. And then uh, within the same study, the Cassiope study, that's the name of the study, uh, we are going to have a second randomization of DARA maintenance during two years versus no maintenance with DARA. So the goal of this study uh, that I have the privilege to share is to uh, uh, demonstrate that the addition of DARA will increase the quality of the response and therefore increase the progression for survival, but also that DARA could be uh, an important uh, drug in the maintenance setting as well. So this study is the pivotal study for the approval of DARA in the context of stem cell transplantation. The study uh, was an open for enrollment uh, last October. Uh, we are now uh, April 2016. We have already enrolled uh, 300 patients and the study will be closed for enrollment Q1 uh, 2017. So in, well, let's say uh, nine months from now. So we have to wait, of course, not, we won't have any uh, uh, result before at best uh, early 2018, something like that.